So th this is kind of an example of what it, what a specification sheet would look like, and they all look different. There's no like one format because whether you're making an iPhone case or a popcorn machine, your specification sheet is going to look very different. But this is just for a backpack, and it's basically a one pager to show. And I've got different tabs up there at the top, like the fabric colors, the bill of materials. Here's the design tab, what it looks like. Here's the type of zips that we're using. Here's what the front, back and sides look like. Here's where the padding compartments look um, uh, are, are fitted. This is the type of uh, handle that we're using, this type of buckle that we're using. And then that's so important because every supplier is going to get the exact same information. So let's say we're doing an outdoor furniture chair and I go to Alibaba and type in outdoor furniture chair. Well, I'm getting quoted prices of what a supplier thinks I want rather than what I actually want. You know, some might quote for steel tubing, some might quote for aluminium tubing, some might quote for polyester fabric, some might quote for nylon fabric, some might be quoting uh, 80 by 40 centimeters, some might be quoting 60 by 30 centimeters. So it's so, so important to give the exact information up front, which you create on a specification sheet, and then you, you can give that to multiple suppliers. Hey, it's Ria Mittal here. Before you leave, make sure to subscribe to Seller App's main YouTube channel where we upload all things Amazon and some how-to guides that will make sure that you're running on Amazon. You will not get this anywhere else. Until the next time, happy selling.